A big step toward teacher and child care provider safety goes into effect today as they are part of the newest group to become eligible for the COVID-19 vaccine. Local 5's Rhonda Fox shows us why this precaution is significant for one county. Each new group that becomes eligible gets us that closer to returning to normal. Wisconsin DHS announced educators and child care providers will soon be eligible for the COVID-19 vaccine. The vaccinations may start Monday, but they will take several weeks. The Winnebago Health Department has surveyed school districts and private schools and child care providers to assure they're all linked to a provider. I say this as a parent, there's been nothing more disruptive than the uncertainty around the schools. So getting our educated, educators vaccinated, getting our schools back to normal, it's just gonna be so huge for so many aspects of life. Teacher eligibility couldn't have come at a better time because Winnebago County is experiencing a spike in positive COVID-19 cases in kids under 18. The youth rates for COVID-19 have rapidly increased in our area and now have the highest rates for COVID-19 of all age groups. That's mostly due to extracurricular activities and club sports. It's a reminder that we got it. We got to get through this last push. So, you know, getting getting our educators vaccinated, um, getting our community members vaccinated. I think that's going to get us over the hump. Teachers and child care providers shouldn't expect to get the vaccine right away as vaccine providers continue to prioritize. We will continue to vaccinate our eligible groups that include the phase 1A as we begin to add on the educators and child care providers. I, I'm very excited. I mean, I'm very optimistic about it. In Oshkosh, Rhonda Fox, Local 5 News. The Wisconsin DHS says educators and child care providers should receive the vaccine in March and early April. The remaining groups can plan to be vaccinated in April and May.